There's not too many spider webs in here anyway. She's starting up a lot quicker than I thought it was gonna. Usually when I leave it for a few months it kind of coughs and splatters and then pops a bit and then runs on one or two cylinders and then it won't any but this time it kind of burst into life. I really wasn't expecting that. It's made for a bit of a short and boring video. <laughs> well boring video anyway really but I get a lot of people say to me oh can you do another one on the focus? Can you do a an update video on it? Well I ain't got any updates on it that's the trouble. Um, that is the that is the trouble, but there we go. I'm pleased it does run. Uh, I'd like to drive it, you know. That's what I need to do, but I need to get it. I found I can't remember. There was someone, and if you're the person, then I'm sorry that I've forgotten it was you. But there was someone who recommended this thing called Dream Science, and it's like um, it's a bit like Bluefin apparently. I've done a bit of research into it. I phoned them up, and apparently it's a bit like Bluefin. A bit like the Nanocom, really, that I got for the Discovery. Um, 
I'm not sure whether it comes with a memory card and you have to put the maps on it or not, but it's like a device that you plug it into the OBD, ODP, OBD, OBD port, and uh, and you flash the ECU with a map that you want. So I'm thinking about doing that. But then again, there's another, there's a person called Empire Tuning or Empire Remaps. I think he's got two companies. He seems to reckon that he can do something with this. Um, he told me to give him a ring. But the trouble is, because I ain't got any money, there's no point in ringing someone and asking them questions about something because all they want to do is they just want to book you in and get it done. But I can't just, you know, if you just ring up and ask questions and then say, oh, well, I can't do it right now because I ain't got enough money, they're like, well, why the hell are you ringing me then? You can tell they're thinking. It's pointless. So I haven't given him a ring. Um, but he, he said, he commented on it. He talked, I talked to him on Instagram a little bit, like he comments on a few pictures. And he reckons he can do something with this. But then again, that's the trouble. If I've, I'm thinking to myself, if I buy this Dream Science thing, if I save up, the only way I'm going to get money for that is from these videos from YouTube. So if I save up for a few months and get, because it's like, I think it's 380 quid or something. If I save up and get that device thing, I can put as many maps on as I want. So I can, you can buy maps that are already done, you know, and just flash it onto the ECU. I'm thinking, if I do that, then I can remap this car as many times as I want to. But then if I pay someone, like this Empire bloke, to come along and do, and you know, that's it then, isn't it? If I want it changed, I've got to go back to him, or to someone else, or to him, and have it done again. So, I'm, 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 I mean, I don't know what to do. Either way, I'm trying my very best to save, but at the same time, I'm trying to save up to because we need to buy a bigger house and everything. So I'm trying to save up in order to get to move. So, you know, it's a tricky thing. But it, it every time I walk past this car on the driveway, uh, my heart sort of sinks a little bit. Cause I think, oh man, it's such a waste. I just wish I could drive it, but I can't. But that is what's going on. I'm really surprised it started up as easy as it did. I do need to, to say the truth, I think the head gaskets at it. Then bubbles coming up in the coolant header tank, the bubbles constantly rising. There's a leak somewhere. I think it's the head gasket, but again that's more expense. I mean I could I do it all myself, so I save on labour. But it's the parts and the time. Well, it would take I could do it in a day. But still it's with the parts, you know, that's going to cost. If I'm going to take the head off, I'm going to have to get that skimmed. Um, if I'm going to get that skimmed, I might as well get it port and polished. Do you, know, do you see what I'm trying to say? Is I can't, I can't see the point in taking the head off and just putting it back on standard. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, it will be a driving video, and we'll go somewhere, and this will be working. So take care, and I'll see you later.